Hey guys, this is the APG Podcast. I'm Giuseppe, your host, and this is... Angel. Stoney here. <laughs> and so we're going to get right into it. We're going to eat some snacks from uh, Korea, I think. Yep. Alright, so these are some uh, beer fries, I think. I don't know, they got beer on them. Uh... Fried. No, no, they're supposed to like... Oh, fried squid snack. Yeah, That's so like, the thing, the image right here, uh, it's like for like people who be drinking, they be eating these, you know? Or to like sober them up? Yeah. That's what you're thinking? Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Right. They ain't got no... What the shit? Boy, they smell so like fish. Yeah, because it's squid, fool. Alright, you ready? Hold on, hold on, hold on. I want a big piece. I'm not trying to... Alright, you ready? What up, what up? Two, two. two. Man, that's a nasty. You know, that's definitely nasty. I don't even want, like, want to... Sw- <laughs> don't want to swallow it, dog. But I'm gonna give this, like, a... Like, a one. But it thinks like nasty. One. You know, I'm, I'm definitely giving this a zero. I love squid. And, like, seafood. But this is not this, just, this, like... That's not it, though. <laughs> This is not so it. funny. Because these are like the, the tentacles, and I think they're like fried or something. Yeah. They're crispy. No, nah, because they're not even crispy. Like, they're they're moist. But they smell bad, too. It's too fishy, though. Like, it ain't got no flavor. It just tastes like squid. Like, plain squid. I thought it was going to have some, like, like some sesame type shit, huh? Mm-hmm. Like, I don't know. Like, they would have put some, like, kind of seasoning, like, yeah. garlic powder or something. Mm-hmm. But, nah, I don't like these. I'm going to give this, like, negative one. Negative one? Yeah, they're nasty. Okay. You know, they would taste better if, they, if we had, like, some hot sauce or something. Like some hot sauce? Like, some hot sauce in there. Mm. Some lime, some salt. Maybe next time we'll bring some, like, hot sauces. Oh, God. So that we can, like, try it in different styles, you know what I mean? Yeah, because, like, this, it's so it. <laughs> yeah, <you're not laughs> That's what we have people drinking over here. But <laughs> <laughs> it probably tastes better when you're drunk. Yeah. You know what I mean? Alright. But tell me a little bit about yourself. Where where are you born? Where are you from? I was born in, in Vegas here in the what is what is the hospital called? Sunrise. I was born there. Sunrise? Yeah. I'm gonna turn six the next uh the fourteenth too, Friday. You gonna turn six? Sixteen, fool. Oh. Okay. And then I'm gonna I'm gonna go I'm gonna go eat and then I was thinking about going to Mexico but now I'm just gonna stay here. I'm gonna go to camp. Are you going to go to the APG yeah. camp? Did you sign up? Nah, I, I need to get with the paper signed. Oh, yeah, go talk to Joy and get signed up. You know yeah. what I mean? Because I went last year. Camp was fun. But this year, we're, um, we're going... Uh, it's in Utah. We got, like, a little Airbnb thing. It's like a mansion. Like, it has, like, eight bedrooms type thing. You know what I mean? Who, who is it? Who is going? Um, well, you're going. I'm going. Joy's going. Landon, and then I can't say the other clients, but and then Rob should be there. I don't know if Rob's daughter's coming. She may, um, because she went last year, but so, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm gonna try to go. Yeah, yeah, uh, two days on. Huh? It's like a mansion I think it's thing, three. it's like a big mansion thing. Uh, it looked big. I'm it got gonna, it got like a pool. I think. I think I'm it gonna be recording. It. I like yeah. We can. New crib. New crib. New crib. <laughs> you um, made out the hood. Nah, you still in here? <laughs> be quiet, you fool. Yeah, but nah, I'm I'm gonna try to go. That's gonna be late then. I'm gonna make out and be like, we're going on a trip. You know, favorite rocket shit. We went through this guy. They'll ask that you know. No so you be jamming out. Okay. Um. So, I don't know. Tell me a little bit more about yourself. Like, how did you how did you find recovery? Uh, nah, cause well, my dad brought me here cause I was using drugs like cocaine, weed, and then like I was addicted and I couldn't stop. So like my dad brought me here, and then I remember the first time I came here, I was scared. You was high. 
Yeah. I would. <laughs> I was you like, was out of your mind, I remember. Yeah, I was I was close to fuck out. I know. And then, like, my lips were busted because my dad did my <laughs> No, I remember um, the first time I started coming to APG when I was a client. Uh-huh. Uh, probably, like, three years ago. No, nah, not three years ago. I was in rehab. Like, two and a half years ago, maybe. Mm-hmm. And uh, we were doing equine therapy at a different place. And they was like, go play with the horses. Mm-hmm. I'm like, why, why would I do that? I'm like, I'm not, I'm not playing the horses. And uh, my sister was with me and my mom. And the lady gave us, like, a, like, you know, thing you put around the horse's yeah. head? She gave us that and was like, go figure it out and put it on the horse. I was like, excuse me? Like, what did you say to me? Like, I'm not... I'm not touching that big horse and getting, like, kicked. You know what I mean? Yeah. So, uh, we ended up figuring it out. And we walked the horse. And it was kind of cool. And then I didn't come back to ABG for, like, a year. Why? Because I just didn't want to come. There was no reason for me to come. Uh-huh. I wanted to chill at the house and play video games. But I was already sober at that point. I already had, like, a year. No. Yeah, I would have had, like, maybe six months, eight months sober. Uh... And I was already going to Mission High School online. Um, online school? Yeah, because this was like right after COVID. Because oh. um, in COVID, I was in rehab. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Um, which was a trip. Because like, I guess people weren't allowed to leave their house. But I was already stuck in the facility where I couldn't leave. So it didn't really make a difference. <laughs> you know <laughs> you were mean? stuck there? Yeah, but I was in Utah. It was well, in Draper, Utah. Well, well. I was in rehab for six months and three days. But I couldn't live with that. Hell no, nah, I would have escaped or something. Well, no, nah, people would try. I don't like being like trapped in places. Uh, I feel like some kid he uh, he ran right, uh-huh. and there was this supervisor named Lafay, mm-hmm. big dude, bro, tall, like probably as tall as that. You mm-hmm. know what I'm saying? And a uh, big Samoan dude, bro, he's strong. And uh, he they they called um they called the runaways a Nike code uh-huh. Nike, and. Uh, you would just, you would look out the window and you see Lofty just so hauling, bro, hauling. <laughs> and but it was crazy. One time they tackled the kid and it like ripped half his, half his face off. It was nasty. But yeah, that's my uh, rehab experience story. So, uh, you ready to go into the next hack? Yeah? Alright. Alright, so we got some, uh, some Mickey's. It's a milk and yogurt flavor. So we're going we're gonna to try Is this expired? No, it's not. It expires next year. So we're going to try this. Uh-huh. It just sounds like soda. This? You see? It has like... Yeah, it's like a... It smells pretty good. It kind of smells like a weird Sprite. Put some on my cup. Why is like foamy? This is like soda. Oh, it does smell like Sprite. Yeah, it smells like a. Yeah, it smells like Sprite, but like flavored Sprite. Yeah, mm-hmm. but like yogurt type thing. Well, it's yogurt flavored. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you ready? Yeah, cheers. Yeah, cool. It tastes like yogurt, like. Yeah, like liquid yogurt. Yeah. Have you ever tried the little things like the little yogurts? They're like red and like red. Oh, uh, uh, the animals. Yeah. Yeah. Those are they taste like the same. Yeah, kind of do. I'm telling you. I'm gonna fuck with this thing. Yeah, no, I know. I like this. I'm gonna get this like an eight. This is dope. I'll buy this. this. I'm gonna get this like a nine. Yeah, this is good. I'll buy this. But I remember when I first tried beer, I threw up. Mm-hmm. <laughs> no, but the first time I tried beer, I was maybe like seven. Well, I was at my grandpa's house. But I, I, I remember my, um, I used to go with my grandmother, mm-hmm. and she used to have like bottles and stuff, like because they're older, right? They'd be drinking, right. and then me and my cousin, like we grab some and we'll pour some up. And then we drank it, and we were acting hella stupid, like, we were not even drunk, but we were just acting like down. Just do it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, I remember, I took, I was, I was younger, I was young, I was like maybe eight, 
and I got some like rum or something. And I wasn't even drunk. Like it took maybe like two sips. And you were acting. And I was I was acting all stupid, bro. I was like acting like I could barely walk, like falling down. Like I was just acting stupid. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. But nah. Either way, like I don't like the taste of beer. It makes me like I don't know. It was nasty. Or I used to love the taste of beer when I was using. I, was, I loved it. It was nasty. Yeah, no, I was weird, bro. Like, hard alcohol, it wasn't horrible. I hated tequila. I love me some vodka, though. I used to drink tequila like crazy. I used to chug bottles and stuff. Bro. Yeah, no, I used to chug bottles of vodka. Vodka? Mm-hmm. No, you, you were doing something else, bro. That's not it. Yeah, bro. And then, uh, beer was good. I love beer. Like, everything that people didn't like, I loved. You know what I mean? But people that, things that people loved, I didn't really like as much. No. You know so you mean? were, like, definitely an addiction? Yeah, like, like people always said shrooms taste horrible. I love to taste shrooms. I used to eat them shits just for fun, just for the taste. For real. What the heck? Yeah. No, you're crazy. So. But, yeah. So how did you, how did you find APG? My, uh, my sister was looking up online, and then we found this alternative group thing. Yeah. That. Alternative peer group? Yeah. <laughs> okay. And then I just started coming, and then I think I'm going to have, like, an ear already here. I think. Yeah, in, like, two or three months. Yeah. Yeah. You have been coming here for a year. Yeah. Uh, I used to be here all the time, huh? But I gotta work now. I mean, you still come damn near every day. Yeah, that's true. Now you come at least four to three days out of the week. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. But there was times like I wouldn't even would come. Be. See, what you used to do is you would come every day for a week, uh-huh. disappear for like a week and a half, and then come back. That's what yeah. you used to do. Because we would catch you like smoking in the bathroom or like... It was stupid stuff. You know what <laughs> yeah. I mean? It was funny. It was always me. Pegging Jake. Pe- Pegging mm-hmm. Jake. Pe- yeah. And it was always me catching you. Always. Because you used to act like you was taking a poop in the bathroom for mad long. But you probably was because it stank when I went up in there. But I would I would go in there, bro. And it would smell like doo-doo. But there it would also smell like weed. I'm like, oh, this this kid, bro. And, and I'm <laughs> like, I remember one time I had like I was smoking in the bathroom. Uh, and then I was like, I hopped back to the bathroom and you went inside. Was like, it smelled like weed. I was like, no. Yeah, bro, because it was all cloudy. I was like, bro. <laughs> and then and then I searched you. Landon might have been there. Yeah. So I searched you a lot with Landon. Yeah, and then you guys didn't find anything. <laughs> I know. I used to get so mad because I was like, I know he's doing something. And then I started drug testing you. Yeah. Because... But nice, like, like I used to say, I, 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 it was like a week ago, two weeks ago. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I used to lie about it all the time. <laughs> you were a pain, bro. Yeah. But you way better now. You oh, wanna, no. Don't tell nobody, but you're one of my favorites. I know. <laughs> <laughs> I like this shit. It's good. No, it's good. It's definitely like an eight or a nine. All right, let's get the next drink or food. Yeah. All right, so now we have um. <laughs> so what? Uh, I don't know. It's made by the same company as the thing we ate last time. It got like some milk boxes and this cow. They look like beans. And they look like beans. And then uh, why is this in English, but the other stuff is in <laughs> Korean? Korean. Mate, mango cow candy, milk flavored. Well, I, I have a feeling this is gonna taste nasty. I don't know. It might. It's gonna be. Oh, they're like actual candies. They're like little candies. All right, you ready? Yeah. Oh, it's gonna be like a high chew. You do that. It's like a. It's good. 
I don't like it. It's like a dried out marshmallow. It's like it's like chalky, but like not. They used to sell these in Mexico, but they're different like brand. kind. Yeah, but they're good. No, I don't like them. Why are you hating? I'm not hating. I'm just saying I don't like them. It's not my favorite. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna give these a one. And you say you like them? That's crazy. I'm giving these a zero. These are not like. They kind of make me want to throw up, bro. You know what I mean? Like, they're not. Have you ever, like, throw up while drinking milk? No. I have. It tastes like that. <laughs> tastes like milk throw up? Yes. That's crazy. So it's definitely a zero. Yeah. Alright. You want me to ask you questions? Huh? You want me to ask you questions? I mean, you can. <laughs> you gotta ask me, like, real questions, though. Uh, have you ever bullied people? Real questions, for That's you. a real question! Hell yeah, I bully people. I bully you all the time. You don't bully me. Yes, I do. It doesn't hurt, though. Exactly, you're still bullying. No. I yes. think bullying is, like, if you bully somebody... And then he gets bullied or like or now that just means that they don't have like that means they're ignorant. No. Yes. That doesn't mean they're ignorant. Do you know what ignorant means? Yeah. Where you don't know something? No. It's where like search it up. No. I bet you anything. I'm t I'm telling you ignorant is that. We'll look it up after, but I'm telling you it don't mean that. Bullying is like making fun of someone even if they don't get hurt. So like, I can be like making fun of you. And you may not get hurt because me and you are tight like that, but like, like with other people, you're like, yeah, I get it. You know what I mean? Because I think some, some like some people have their like their emotions like really down, so like everything. Like their mental health. Yeah. Yeah. I like don't get hurt. Because like me and you, we can mess around. Yeah. You know I mean, with other kids, I gotta be a little more Gentle. sensitive because they're not in yeah. the like right headspace or or like things like that. You know what I mean? I think like it's like cool to like mess around like. As long as you're good with the person, you know? Right. Yeah. Because, like, me and my dad joke around all the time. Right. <laughs> and it's funny because, like, we just make it. Because you guys are close. You know what I mean? Yeah. You guys are tight. But, and like, if, I, if I'm, like, walking up to a client and I don't know him that well, and I just start, like, making fun of him. No, I mean, they may think that I mean it in, like, a bad way. Yeah. You know what I mean? And, like, trying like to Like, offending them, yeah. Right. But, like, when me and you do it, you know I'm not trying to hurt your feelings or nothing. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So, yeah. Thanks. Next candy. Next candy. Yeah. All right. So this looks like a. Uh, have no idea. I, I have no. Oh, idea. I tried this. Kimchi, kimchi. I tried this. My sister would get this because she likes Korean stuff, and she always get this. It's like salad with like different flavors, like like hot sauce or stuff. But it's good. Yeah. Boy. You open it, I ain't got no nails. There we go. Alright, you ready? Yeah. It's much anyway. They're good. It's good. It tastes like hot sauce. It's spicy, but not that spicy. No, there's like no spice to it. You no, know, this would taste good on some noodles. Oh no, it definitely would. Huh? Hmm. Oh, I need some more. All right, so what you say again? I'm gonna give this a five. I don't know, bro. I think I'm gonna give this like a six, maybe seven. Pretty good. It's honestly. good, but like, I think it's just like a one time thing, you know? Like, yeah. You know, something like some noodles. You gotta mix it up and stuff. Yeah. yeah. I don't know, cause like. You know, they make rice with this? Kimchi rice? Oh, they do? Yeah, it's good. Cause looking at the thing, 
I thought, I thought it was gonna have some meat in it. Nah. Like, oh, meat it might have like some beef or something. In it. Like they added spam sobe, kimchi, and rice. That's a perfect rice. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um. Well, uh, have you have you you do sports? No. Why not? Um, I just never got into them when I was little. Cause you 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 never like like running or doing stuff. Like no, that. like I was a fast runner. I used to run hella fast. I know. But you used to run from cops, huh? Yeah, when I was using. Say you sir. Mm-hmm. How many times? I don't know. I didn't keep count. Wow. It just kind of happened. Um. But no, I didn't really play sports. Um, the most like closest thing to a sport that I did was I used to ride scooters in middle school. I used to like do tricks and stuff on yeah. them at the skate park. I, I used to have a scooter too. I used to have a, a Lucky scooter. Mm-hmm. That's the brand I used to buy. Yeah. And I used to like, customize it and I used to do tail waves. One time I fell in and I almost like broke my, my leg. That's yeah, all the scars I got on this arm are from all the me? skate park, yeah. And then I, one time when I was using, I was, uh, I was running from the cops, ironically, and, um, I was on a skateboard and I was going down this big hill and I hit like a rock. And you flew. Bro, I flew. And I went like this and it like ripped off like a little piece of my hand. Uh-huh. Not ripped off, but like, shit, yeah. it was noticeable. You know what I mean? And, um, I was like, wow, that's crazy. And I was, I was on all kinds of pills. And I couldn't really feel it, but I was like, that's crazy. And I rode my skateboard back home. And I was like, what happened to your hand? Cursing at me, tripping out. And I was like, I don't know. <laughs> and she started tripping like, you got to go to the hospital. I'm like, no, I'm fine. And she like, just put some like rubbing alcohol on it. Some, uh, what's that stuff called? Hydrogen peroxide and just wrapped it up in a bandage and it healed fine. But you can still kind of see it like right here. Yeah, I love you do. Yeah. But that shit was crazy. Next time. Did, hold on. Did, oh. did you used to do sports? I used, I used to do soccer, boxing, mm-hmm. taekwondo, and then kick your hands. <laughs> right. but, but I started doing soccer because I used to play when I was in Mexico. So I was living there for like four years. Right. And then I stopped and I came here. And I joined taekwondo. And then I got like my brown belt. And then I went to boxing mm. and I still have amateur fights like advanced fights and then I had like two of them that I won and then the last one I lost so mm. I had to stop because I got depressed I mean I got I know uh, one of my friends is from my old high school mm. he um she does um MMA and stuff out in California swear mm. I don't like MMA yeah. Make sure you get hit, knockout. No, not like any hit. What? So you like doing like boxing and stuff? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, because he does MMA. He mainly focused on like boxing and wrestling. Mm-hmm. He's not bad. He's pretty good. But yeah, why did you stop doing all the other sports? Because I had to come here. I'm doing yeah. my. I'm. I'm gonna just get back to them like soon. Cause I'm just gonna. I was trying to get like clean and shit. Right. And then the sports. <laughs> but I'm clean, so I'm, I'm going to try to get like, into sports more now. Okay. Yeah. I want to do Taekwondo. Yeah. yeah. I'm going to go to the little corner right there. Mm-hmm. I'm going to go there. Start beating people up? Yeah. Mm-hmm. I don't know. I'm going to get my ass beat. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Let's get the next nine. Yeah. All right. So now we got um, spicy rice. Uh, spicy rice cake flavor. Oh, maybe it is noodles. Let me see. This is don't boil it, smash it. Yeah, I know. You're not supposed to cook it like. Mm-hmm. Smash. All right, take out spices and smash those. Well, fuck. Uh, sprinkle spices and enjoy. All right, cool. All right, music. Smash. I already smashed it. Oh. All right, so now we have a uh, spicy rice. Uh, now we have a spicy rice cake flavor, flavored noodle kind of thing. Um, 
So we're going to try this out. Hold this, wait. Yeah, hold this. Wait. It's not like noodles. Really? <laughs> it's crazy. I thought it was gonna be like a. Oh, it is a powder. Why are you trying to do <laughs> she kind of spicy. You're gonna do it like this. Like this, bro. It's already gone. I'm a professional because I used to do that with baggies. <laughs> Don't try it yet, don't try it yet. Yeah, let's see. Alright, let's see it. That looks pretty good. Yeah, low key. Alright, ready? Cheers. It's good. I like it. Oh, you do. I'm going to give this. I will eat this like me watching videos and shit. So I'll give this a 10. Just like chilling and snacking? Yeah. Watching a movie stuff. You know? I'm going to give this a 10. I'm going to give another one. Yeah, I'm definitely going to give it like a 9. 9.5. These are pretty good. Mm -hmm. I buy these. You don't even need water or boil it. Yeah, because I was about to cook those, bro. I thought they was, those were like noodles. <laughs> they look like noodles. Mm hmm. I said don't smash or don't boil, smash. Yeah. What? I'm going to give this a tank. Okay. Um, what is three goals you have? Just. In goals general. in general that you want to accomplish by this time next year. Uh, I'm trying to learn more things like in construction mm -hmm. and like, cause I'm trying to get my company, but I still need time cause I don't know that much stuff, you know, from, right. like I know a lot of stuff from my age, but like not the things that I like, I don't know to be a control company, you know, but I'm trying to learn how to do business and marketing. I'm going to do that. And then, I'm going to go join a school for just construction. Like a trade school? Yeah. And then I might be able to, I'm, I'm going to try to get a check. That's my goal right there. Yeah. yeah. Right. What's your goals? Two goals. Three goals. Um, I want to get my peer recovery support specialist certification. Mm -hmm. um, get a car. Mm -hmm. And then hopefully go back, go to college to become a social worker. That's good. Mm -hmm. A social worker? Mm -hmm. So you know what Ari does? Yeah. She's yeah. a social worker? Mm -hmm. That's good. Mm -hmm. Bank money. Mm -hmm. yeah, but it's good money. It's okay. Yeah. That's like $20,000 more than what I make right now. And then yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah. Yeah. All right. Is there anything that you want the audience to know about you, or uh, say anything like that? I'm a nerd. He is a nerd. <laughs> no. Nah. Nah. I don't think so. Yeah. Oh, I'm funny. I'm hilarious. Nah, you just funny looking. Stop playing. <laughs> Cut. Thank you. All right. Well, that's the end of the podcast. Uh, hope you guys Thank enjoyed. Thank you guys for watching. See you next time. Peace out. Doses. <laughs>